Hello everyone. Welcome you all in video series of basic mechanical engineering subject. In this video, you will learn basic concept of water level indicator with their function, their location, construction and working. Now we will see one by one. So first start with the construction. So two water level indicator are provided on all the boilers. So in this figure you can also see that the water level indicator is attached to front plate of the boiler. It consists of a metal tube and a glass tube with marking hose and pass through the stepping box. So in this figure uh, you can see that uh, the front uh, plate tube, metal tube and glass tube. So here uh, this is the metal tube and here this is the glass tube. Here this is the in yellow color that is the end plate of boiler. So glass tube is made of uh, toughened glass so that it can withstand the boiler. So the upper and lower end of this tube are connected to hollow gun metal casting Upper casting has steam cock and lower casting has water cock. So in this figure uh, we can see that uh, this, is, this is the steam cock and this is the water cock and here this is the hollow gun metal casting. So this is for upper side and this is for lower side. So upper casting is bolted to the boiler plate in the steam space by flange while Lower casting is bolted to the boiler plate in the water space by flange. The steam cock and water cock open in vertical positions. So uh, this is the uh, this is the upper casting and this is the uh, lower casting. So in in, the, in this case we can see that uh, this is the fitted with the uh, flange. This is for upper side and this flange is for lower side. So here this is the water entering area and this is the uh, stream entering area. So if uh, this steam cock and this water cock is in, is in vertical position uh, means the cock is open. So the third cock is called drain cock is provided to blow out water at the intervals so that any sediments uh, present in water do not accumulate and this ensure that the steam and water passes are clear. So drain cock closes in vertical positions. So there are the main uh, three valves this steam cock, this water cock and this uh, drain cock. If the, if the position of the drain cock is vertical that means it is close. So it is different than uh, two cock. So mostly uh, drain cock is uh, used uh, for steam and water passages are clear. Glass tube is protected by the gas rail made of toughened glass. So in this figure we can see that this is the uh, glass, glass seal. Uh, this protect the uh, glass tube. Seal hold flying pieces of glass in the event the glass tube breaks the protecting of the operator from the being hurt it provide with the screw cap for the clearing purpose. So this is the construction of the water level indicator. Now uh, we study uh, the working of this water level indicator. So when the steam cock and water cock are open uh, means it is in vertical directions. The two balls provided inside the gun metal casting remain in the position. So if uh, this steam cock is vertical position means this is to open. So next the steam rushes from the upper passes and the water rushes from the lower passes uh, to the glass tube. The water, the level of water inside the boiler will be same as seen in the glass tube. So here uh, this is for uh, steam passes for the upper, upper end and this is the water passes uh, to the lower end. So the level of water uh, inside the boiler will be same as seen in glass tube. So the level will be checked by the glass tube. 
in case of glass tube breaks accidentally the water and steam simultaneously rush out to the gun metal casting so here uh, this is the gun metal casting so force is exerted on two balls and any they are carried away by the water and steam closing the pass passages the water and steam cocks are then closed and the glass tube are replaced so here this is the water balls and this is the uh, steam cock and water clock will be uh, closed means its direction will be horizontal and we can replace the glass tube in the case of accidentally damage so this is the working of the water level indicator in the next slide uh, we will see the function of the uh, water level indicator so it indicates the water level inside the boiler uh, to the observers and the one the operator to take the corrective action if the water level if the level of water falls below the minimum level so main function of the water level indicators to maintain the level let's show to the observer now a location it is located in front of the boiler in such a position so that it is easily seen by the boiler operator so normally water level indicator is located in front of the boiler so observer where the observer uh, can visibly uh, visible so if you find my video very helpful you can like comment share and subscribe now next slide uh, we will see the important question for the university exam the first one explain the very briefly the function of the following mountings uh, that is the water level indicator so next one is the explain with the nearest sketch water level indicator with the nearest sketch explain the construction and working of the water level indicator so this type of exam will be asked in, in university exam so if you find my video very helpful you can like comment share and subscribe thank you and if you find my video helpful you can like comment share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you